What's up guys, Crazy BR, Crazy HD, whatever, I'm done correcting myself at this point. Um, and today I'm bringing you guys just my, my thoughts on Battlefield 1 uh, from the beta. Um, so, yeah. So, um, you, you guys are going to be seeing a lot of this gameplay in the next couple months. Um, well, yeah, in the next couple months because I'll probably be playing it a lot once it comes out. Um, I have $40 down on it now and I plan on going and putting the last $40 down once I get some more money. Um, at, I was waiting for after the beta because um, I was kind of skeptical about how they would execute the World War One thing, but I believe that they executed it very well. Um, I don't know what gameplay is in the background. I don't know if it's even a good gameplay. I have a lot of good and bad gameplays. I'm trying to make it good, but hopefully it's not unbearable. Um, but I have uh, a lot of sniping gameplay, a lot of, I have a gameplay with every class, and um, from the beta, it's, it seems really hard to rank up your classes to get to different, like, like in battle, in the previous battlefield, you could rank up classes and unlock different guns, but there's also war bonds, so you can get different guns and better guns, and personally, I like the, um, the second medic gun that I bought better, I forget what it's called, but... I'm not really good with the gun names, just so you guys know, so forgive me for that, but um, I've been using everything, and I really haven't found anything that I don't like. Um, there was the semi-automatic gun that the medic starts out with that I didn't really like, but I had war bonds, so I just bought a, an automatic, I think it's a submachine gun, no, assault rifle, sorry. Um, so I just bought an automatic assault rifle, and uh, but I've tried out planes, I've tried out different types of vehicles. I've driven the freight, the, the armored train, I don't know why I called it a freight train, um, multiple times, and it's all really fun. Um, flying planes is a little bit harder than I'm used to. Um, I always sucked at it anyway, but I suck even more in Battlefield 1. I don't know if it's different controls or what, it just seems a little bit harder. I think it's kind of little slower. I mean, obviously back in the, back in the day the planes were a lot slower. Um, there's, I only have really one complaint about it, and it's that they don't really utilize more trench warfare. There's not really any trenches on at least the one map I saw. Um, I'm hoping that in the actual game there is some trenches. Um, but it's really seems really balanced. Um, a lot of snipers are... Uh, a lot of people are sniping because they made the sniping a lot easier in this game, and there's a zero distance to make it even easier than it was in previous games. Um, and that's just pressing down on the d-pad. I'm pretty sure it's, it's universal, so I'm pretty sure it's for PS4 also. Because um, I just assumed that the d-pad would be the same thing. Um, so, I personally am really excited for this game to come out. Um, I was kind of skeptical at first, when, like I said, when I saw that they were doing the World War One thing. But they really did, I think EA and... Uh, Dice did a really good job on this. I think it's Dice making it. I don't know. I'm probably an idiot, and it's not. But whatever. EA EA's doing a really good job, even though they're just the publisher, and whoever's developing the game is doing a really good job. So, um, in my opinion, if you guys are um, skeptical at all, just download the beta. It's free. Um, and decide from there. I'm not going to tell you to buy a game if you don't want to buy it. If it's not your type of game. If you don't really like first-person shooters and you won't like this game, um, I'd definitely start out with something easier, like COD or something, if you want to play, get into the first-person shooter genre that you're, and you're not really sure what to do, uh, what game to play. Um, but regardless, it's a, it's a pretty fun game so far. Ooh, excuse me, so far. So definitely give it a try if you haven't tried out the beta or... Uh, when it comes out, see if you can borrow it from a friend or something. But yeah, so that's going to do it for this video, guys. Kind of like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, be down in the description below. As always, guys, have a crazy HD. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. See ya.